The bands and the fans get all the attention, but there's unsung heroes at Glastonbury, the people who clean up the mess. There's 20,000 waste and recycling bins at the festival, but not everybody's using them. 1,500 staff spend six hours a day just picking up litter. That's uh, about 50% mud. And you wonder what's going to be left for the cows, really, don't you? Yes, yeah, it's, it's alright. Yesterday was much easier because there wasn't any bands on and stuff, so there wasn't litter everywhere. But this morning was really difficult. Um, took a long time to get to the stage. Why did you decide to do it? We couldn't afford tickets. <laughs> we wanted to come to Glastonbury, so we thought we'd give a little back to get something in return. And it's worth it? <laughs> so far, when I think. Do, when you've cleared the site and you look back, it is quite good. Rewarding. <laughs> yeah, rewarding. Yeah. It's a tough gig, but somebody has to do it when everybody else is partying.